morning guys, it's the Sleepy Sanctum reporting in as always in the early mornings. Here uh, we have uh, the first uh, deck list by my good buddy G Larry Turk. Uh, this was one of the original prototypes for the <laughs> Blackwing um, deck. Of course there are two versions to it, there's the pre-edit and there's the Final Cut Pro. Final Cut Pro will be uploaded later today, recording both of them right now. Um, so as you can see, pretty standard build. This was Larry back in the day before he knew too much about like all these stupidly decent cards. And uh, so yeah, well, let's go over them real quick. See which one of these, which what, what these guys do, and how useful they are. Uh, Chris the Crackadon used to um. Holy fuck, I think that iTunes music is just a wee bit too loud. Alright, there we go. I apologize. Let's get back into it. This guy couldn't be destroyed once returned by the effects of spells or traps. Really nice. Uh, sure, would special summon a monster when it destroys one by battle. That is a low, that is an attack point of 1500 or less. Borrow this piercing damage and be special summon if you have another black wing. Uh, Zephyras came back from the grave but paying 400 life points, an effect that could be used once per duel by uh, balancing one face of card on your side of the field. Kalut was the main monster in the deck next to Gale the Whirlwind. Kalut, uh, you could stack Kalut's effect during the damage step giving, giving up to plus 4200 attack points to a Blackwing monster as every time you dropped a Kalut it gave plus 1400 to the black when you dropped it to, uh, and it stacked, so it was really damn nice. Uh, Gale the Whirlwind, really useful. Light Boar can be special summon. Light Chris can be special summon. There's a black wing on the field other than itself, um, and its effect is you cut attack and defense in half permanently of monster. Uh, to the original build ran the two Panakis. But Naki is Larry's best friend. That dude searches whatever Larry needed. Uh, Blizzard was there to make the thong whenever the hell Larry needed to burn that 800 and get that extra normal summon in. That real goosh. Back in the day, Larry only ran two layers because, you know, fuck it. We're not, uh, we're not fucking hipsters. Uh, the one Regeki. That's so goosh, man. Destroy your field. Blow your shit up. Black Whirlwind, people accuse him of stacking because if he'd open one, like, uh, people are like, yo, your deck's too good. And it just allows you to search for a Black Wing. So, but the Black Wing has to be weaker than the Black Wing you summon. So it's like OTK for days. Yeah, sell him warning. Let the dude in the, let the dude in the picture. He's just telling his girls to sit the fuck down. Don't, don't, don't fuck ugly men, bitches. Be good bitches. Blizzard. Yeah, I've heard Blizzard. One Gladius. Motherfucker can only be special summon uh, if there's only one face of Black Moon Monster. So it's a sketchy situation. Yeah, it was Panaki. Uh, it was Panaki's decent friend. <laughs> Though, uh, made it easy in the thong with it, and it could tank. It could tank battle. Uh, Zorogo, the original G from my deck, which got migrated over into Larry's deck, because Larry had a lot of fun with this guy. This guy, plus the Swarm, made Sirocco or any Blackwing gain like 10,000 attack points for the turn. It's really funny. Um, it also be normal summon with attribute if you have uh, no monsters. So, uh, Aroshi, same as all the other little motherfuckers, if you get special summon, if, uh, if you control a black ring other than himself. However, when you use the secret summon, you can change the battle position of, of any monster on the field. Uh, one bottomless, destroy, banish, uh, high attack monsters. Uh, one drowning, back in the day, it was G. Uh, just shuffle the, the one direct attack or whatever. You shuffle monsters in the deck. Pretty self explanatory. Yeah, two, uh, uh, Quaking Mirror Force. Yo, send those bitches face down so I can poke them to death with Boro. Uh, you got the one day of pizza, cause you know, who doesn't fucking love pepperoni and cheese? That two dark holes, cause you know, who doesn't like Detroit? Uh, I mean, I mean, science. 
I mean science. Yes, that one solemn strike, that's when I got his first strike. He was like, yo, this card is so fucking good. It's easy, it's easy money, man. This card is so fucking good. Easy money. Um, and the one uh, hurricane the tornado, Larry's secret tech. Um, but basically copy, uh, copy, uh, Rikiri or Hachio and go fucking ape shit. Now the, the Black Mirror extra deck looks a little funky. If we press sword, you'll find out that it's actually the original prototype was free of everything. E. This was the first build. There was no Black Rose. There was no this originally. Uh, we got Rikiri. Motherfucking pop shit. We got Chidori. Motherfucker kill shit. High job, motherfucker bring back shit. Motherfucker tank shit on Iron Master and the thong motherfucker burn shit. That's all, that's all we really need to put to it, you know. Like, I think this is the way Larry Turk would have given his deck profile. Uh, deck day. He would have given this deck profile in the exact same way I said it. So I hope we represent my boy Larry G uh, pretty well. Uh, I gotta get going to local soon, but I just want to get this recording in. As always, all these videos that I've recorded over the past few days will be going up on the channel tonight, so stay tuned, boys. As soon as I get back to locals, I am hitting the gym in terms of these videos, and I'm gonna plow my nutsack into all of them. It's gonna be G-Dogs. Anyways, take care, homes, and hope you like it, Larry.